All right, welcome everybody. Day eight, you know the drill, you know where we are, you know where we at. Becoming available, availability, availability to yourself, availability to others, availability to the entire universe. We can gain this perspective, we can gain this insight, we can gain this knowledge by simply coming back to a still position every single day. Every single day, I'm getting stronger and stronger. My willpower is getting stronger and stronger. My ability to turn inwards in a non-objective way, in a non-analyzing way, in a non-critiquing way, in a non-comparing way, in a non-judging way is getting stronger and stronger. This is what we're developing. Whether it's through this meditation, or it's through yoga, or it's through lifting weights, or it's through walking, or it's through jogging, or yogging, <laughs> whatever it is, it could be reading a book, you get into your zone in a meditative state by reading, it doesn't matter. What matters is you come back to it consistently. As we've been saying this whole time, this is not, it's not rocket science and you know that and I know that and I'm so that that's why every single day I'm so glad you're here because it's a choice it's a choice for me to be here it's a choice for you to be here and now we get to experience each other energetically by staying open and staying open is just another key word symbolic word of being available being available to every moment of the day, of every moment of your week, of every moment of your month, of every moment of your year. Now, instead of looking at it as a goal, like I'm going to do this by the end of this year, I want to know, here's what I'm interested in. Can you bring to each moment your entire self? You're not detached about thinking I need to be doing something else. No, somebody trips or falls on the side of the street you go and help them I had this experience yesterday somebody knocked over uh, there was a grocery store that was open and some uh, uh, a woman who had tied up her dog outside and she had just left and the dog leaped forward to go see another dog that was passing by and all of this produce just came crashing down on this on the sidewalk and people were walking by nobody was helping and I said immediately no knee-jerk reaction let's help so we did, my daughter and I, we went over, we helped. She was profusely thanking us for helping. And I thought, isn't this such an interesting thing that the norm has been to just pass by, to be an observer and just pass by. But what is it? If we're, if we're available to each moment, we're in that moment. If somebody needs help, boom, we're helping. I mean, the power behind that, if the whole world got behind this, Right? which we're attempting to do now, which we're all attempting to find some sort of footing in this uncertain time that we're in, right? With everything that's going on. So what do we know? What do we know that's certain in all the uncertainty is that we can come and do this, right? We can come and do this. Turn inwards. Visualize and, and get emotionally um, fired up from what drives each one of us and it's different people places things they're all different just like each one of us is unique in our own right and so are our practices so I reiterate again there is no right or wrong way to do this you want to have your legs crossed great you want to lay down great you want to put your hands in a mudra great you want to light sage great you want to um, place flowers in front of you great you don't want to do any of that great and you say, well, that's not much direction. That's all the direction that you need. Well, what do I do? Whatever you feel like doing. Whatever is most comfortable for you. Let's go. Adjust yourself. Close down your eyes. You are available. You are available right now. You are available because you sat down, laid down, did whatever you needed to do to be here right now. That first door of availability, wide open. A few deep breaths. Relax all the muscles around the eyes. Let's go. You remember the 
symbolic nature of the breathing, right? I'm breathing in things that light me up, images that light me up. I'm breathing in mantras that light me up. I'm breathing in just the sense of air moving in. Letting go of all the rest on the exhales. that awareness, that very, very, very powerful awareness, and like we always do, relax the face, relax the forehead, all the muscles across, really feel it, again, the muscles around the eyes, if there's any gripping there, get rid of it, simply let it go on one of your exhales. your lower jaw. That's a big one. An easy place for tension, worry, fear, anxiety to grip. But you say now, I see you. I feel you. You're no longer needed right now. Thank you very much. The same is true with your neck and all the muscles surrounding the neck, maybe for the first time right now. Your awareness is surrounding the muscles of your neck and oh, your head might even move around some. Remember, no right or wrong. If you need to move, you move. This idea of stillness doesn't mean you don't move. Life is movement. Relax. Feel those arms, the weight of your arms. Notice where they're resting. Are they resting on your body somewhere? Are they resting on a piece of furniture somewhere? Where are they? What are they doing? And how do they feel? Notice the chest, the area surrounding the heart. If there's any tension there, let it go. The belly. Oh, the belly. Breathe into it, especially the lower portions. Get one over-exaggerated. Let it stretch, let it expand. And then let it contract, let it all go. No sense of time, space need to rush anything. There is no force, ever. You imagine a sphere around your hips, all the area surrounding outside the hips, and you go deep, deep, deep within the hips signal to your muscles you say you speak to them hey thank you guys thank you gals thank you all thank you all for doing your job but now I need for you to relax go ahead and relax and just like that the hips signaling down to the legs to do the same really feel and notice your inner thighs and just let that line from the inner thighs go all the way down the inside of the legs past the knees into the calves and the outside of the leg the outer thigh all the way down the outside the outer shin all the way down to your ankle and now your feet where are they in space mind drift somewhere else thinking about something else it's okay you tell it you tell your conscious mind hey this is where we are come back hey 
this is where we are. Come back, soles of the feet relaxed. Toes relaxed. This is the doorway to availability. This is the pathway that leads to availability, leading from this place. Not from the mind, from here. Anytime the mind wants to get back involved, drop back down to your hands, drop back down to the heartbeat. Say thank you so much, conscious mind. We'll take care of that later. I got you. Compassion, 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 compassion. You're in control. Breathe into the space. A few conscious, heartfelt breaths. we've done already the four seven eight breathing meditation all you're doing is following my count four on the inhale seven count to holding at the top of that inhale and an eight count on the exhale and then we'll repeat it all right just focused on you and your breath you and your heart in order to open up even more so by the time we come to the completion of this following the breath via numbers our minds are vibrating at such an amazing frequency that our hearts too vibrate at an amazing frequency and they connect there's coherence between both and then we blast out into the world you see and feel your life, how you wish to feel on a daily, how you wish to be available each moment. Here we go. Wherever you are in your breath cycle, exhale everything out. Inhale, here we go. Two, three, four, hold. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale. Two, three, four, five. 
five, six, seven, eight. Do the best you can. Inhale, two, three, four. Hold it, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful. Inhale, two, three, four. Hold it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here we go. Exhale. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Doing great. Eight. Inhale. Two, three, four. Hold. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful. Inhale. Two. Relax. Three, four. Hold. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, exhale, two, nice, three, four, all the confidence, five, six, seven, eight, inhale, two, three, four, hold it, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Stay with it. Inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, five. Six, relax, seven, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, beautiful, inhale, two, keep going, three, relax, four, hold, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, exhale it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale, two, three, four.
easy, easy breathing now. Easy breathing. Notice any sensations that arise. Anything from a warmness beneath your hands to vibrations in specific places in your body or the entire body. Images that may be popping up and crossing your mind, videos that play across the screen of your mind. Maybe it's just colors against the backs of the eyelids. Blackness across the back of the eyelids. from this very available, very open space for less than a minute leading from your heart. All I want you to do is go into your mind, go into your heart, the two connected and create, conjure up, imagine that place we've been doing for the last seven days, last eight days. A scene, a scenario, something that brings about emotion inside of you. Of all your desires, goals, dreams, met already. Not in the future, not outside you somewhere. Done. Right now. Go. See your surroundings. Feel that person standing next to you, across from you, the gaze of their eyes, a friend that you're on a trip with, a group of family members gathering for the first time in a long time. How does that feel? An accomplishment that you've been working years on, done. What does that feel like? Go there. Experience all the senses. All of them. Go. exactly where you are right now, remembering it. Staying in it longer if you like. Or knowing that again, as always, this is a touchstone to keep coming back to as you move through your day. This is a reminder that your reality is not created outside of you. The reality you create starts within you right here, doing exactly what we're doing. So you take that and you bring your awareness back to the place that let us hear your heart. And you thank yourself. You thank your heart for beating, you thank your body for working, your mind for functioning and express tremendous, infinite amounts of gratitude for everything, all of it. And it's from this state of gratitude we will complete this session today together. One deep breath into the nose. 
letting all of this go, exhale out through the mouth. The hands release when you're ready, the eyes open up when you're ready. That was a journey. And as always, using this journey in this moment as momentum for the rest of your day. Each day, a chance to start that momentum over, to start that momentum up. Not dependent on the previous day, not dependent on anything in the future, just right now, right now. And let me tell you something, if you're doing this and if you're watching this and if you're listening to this right now, I need you to know how powerful you are for taking the time to do this. If you haven't given yourself a pat on the back or a hug already, go on and do it now. <laughs> but like the end of every session, I am so glad to be here with you and I'm very excited to be back with you tomorrow. I'm bowing thanks.